Do you know you can also tie center knot with your sego? So watch and follow every step that I'm going to take from this video and you're going to get everything right. The length I'm working with is 74 inches while the width is 37 inches. So I started by folding this fabric into two, then place it on my head. The measurement I'm using is 50-50. So after placing it on my head now, I'm going to be taking it to the back, I'm arranging it now. After arranging, I will take it to the back and cross it. So after crossing it now, I will take the remaining again to the front, work with the side closer to my ear. Okay, so you can see now, I'm going to open, after arranging, I will open everything up. So this fabric is very strong so you don't have to also take it easy with the fabric too okay so i'm folding some edges in now then i will take one side up to form few pleats so you can see i'm taking it up now i'm going to form few pleats here after forming the pleats i'm going to be holding the tip so i will grab the tip one side now so i'm done with one side i'll repeat the same thing i did with the other side i'll fold some inches in take it up and form few pleats okay that's the same thing i did in the other side i'm repeating the same thing here so once i'm done forming the split i'm going to be knotting it twice at the center okay so that is why it's called center knot okay i'm going to knot it twice after knotting it, I'm going to secure it with a pin. So if today is the first time you are coming across my video, thank you very much for watching this video to this point. I really appreciate. Please don't forget to share this video to your friends, your family, your loved ones, so that you can also learn how to tie different types of head wrap by themselves through me. Okay. Thank you very much for doing that. Thank you for sharing this video. I really appreciate. So I'm knotting it now. So that is the first one. I will knot it again. I'm arranging it now. Then knot it the second time. After knotting, I'm going to secure it with a pin. So I'll secure the remaining with a pin. So once I'm done securing the center, now see one side here, I'm going to fold this into two and tuck the remaining in. So watch carefully. You just have to try your best. The fabric is very strong, so you just have to try your best to tie this head wrap, okay? So I'm done with one side now. I'm going to repeat the same thing in this other side. I'm going to fold it into two then tuck the remaining in so watch as i achieve this so after folding it i'm going to tuck it in then secure both of them with a pin okay you can actually leave it like this but i decided to secure with a pin so once i'm done securing the next thing is to arrange it once i'm done arranging i am done with it you can see it is very easy and very simple okay so make sure you try this out by yourself practice so that you can be able to tie it by yourself okay so don't forget to follow this page for more head wrap and also like this video after watching leave a comment and don't forget to share this video to your friends to your family so they can also learn how to tie their head wrap by themselves thank you very much for doing that i really appreciate thank you for watching this video thank you for sharing thank you for following this page thank you for all that you are doing i really appreciate so this is the outcome of it how do you see it write it at the comment section so see you in my next video bye bye